Hello everyone and welcome. iOS 18 adds a new option for both locking apps with Face ID or Touch ID and hiding them entirely from your home screen. And I'm going to show you how to do both of these in this video. Firstly, I'm going to show you how to simply lock an app so that either Face ID or Touch ID is required to open it. So I'm going to demonstrate with YouTube, which is in the top right hand corner of my home screen. If I just tap on it, as you can see, it launches norm as normal. But if I go back to the home screen and I haptic touch on the icon, so I just tap and hold it for a second, you'll see we have an option at the bottom for require face ID. If I tap that, you see I've got two options and I'm going to tap the first option that says require face ID. So it's just going to authenticate and now this app is locked. So if I tap on YouTube now, you see it's going to quickly scan my face and then it's going to launch the app. Again, I can go back home, tap it, authenticates with Face ID and then the app opens. So that app is now locked. Now if I want to remove this lock, all I have to do again is long press on the YouTube app icon and tap don't require Face ID. It just does a quick scan of my face. I can go back into it as before uh, without Face ID being required. We can also completely hide YouTube from this home screen as well as from the app library so it would be hidden from both places. So to do this I'm going to long press again. I'm going to go to require face ID but this time I'm going to choose the second option that says hide and require face ID. And now I'm just going to get a little splash screen here which will just let me know what's going to happen. So it's going to hide it from my lock screen and within the app library and it's going to put it into a specific hidden folder and I'm also not going to receive any notifications or any alerts from the app if it's locked. So I'm going to tap hide app and you see it disappears from my home screen. Now if I swipe to the right you can see I have got my app library. Just to show that it really has disappeared if I go to the top for search and I search for YouTube you can see I can't find it anywhere. Now if I want to find YouTube, I can just go out of search and from my app library, if I scroll all the way to the bottom, you can see we've got a hidden folder in the bottom left of my screen. If I tap on that, it's just going to scan my face with Face ID and you'll be able to see that YouTube has appeared. I can now tap on it, it's going to scan my face again and I'm into YouTube and I can go back out and it's gone back into the hidden folder and it's not visible uh, from the app library. Again, I can tap on hidden and it reappears. Now if I want to unhide YouTube again I can tap and hold on the icon and then tap on don't require face ID. It scans my face and it's put my YouTube app back into the app library. You can see it just over here in the bottom right and if I want to put it on my home screen again I can just drag it out and take it back to where it was and that's YouTube now back on my home screen. And that's how you lock and hide apps on your home screen in iOS 18. If you found this video helpful, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, then feel free to put them in the comment section of this video. Please consider subscribing to the channel and don't forget to hit the notification bell icon so you're notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.